I'm the one that won the contest, and thanks to Mexico Electric Center, I am here. I'm very, very grateful for them giving me the opportunity because um, when I kept looking up uh, these hospitals and who to turn to and where to go, um, I couldn't find one that would set me at ease. And when I went to Baton Rouge to Louisiana and I met up with Dr. Cabrera, he put me at ease, everyone there. Um, and I ended up coming out here. I reserved my plane flight. And flying in, I was still a little, I got a little nervous, I gotta tell you, because we thought you're going to Mexico and we've heard many bad things about Mexico. But to tell you the truth, it's nothing like that, not at all. When I landed and Arturo came up to me, I mean him and his little, you know, he's a little bundle of joy. Victor, I'm sorry, Victor, that's his name, Victor. He's a little bundle of joy, I'm so sorry about that. Um, he picked me up and we went and we picked up the rest of the ones that were coming out here the rest of the time. And when we got to the motel, I mean, the Hyatt, that is a beautiful, beautiful motel. Very comfortable beds, you know how we are about beds. <laughs> it was very comfortable. And then the following day, uh, Jesse brings, I mean Art, I'm sorry, Art brings us over to the hospital. We started our, our pre-op at seven in the morning and my surgery was soon after that. I mean, I went in and went out, didn't even feel a thing. I still don't feel a thing. I mean, I already had my surgery. I mean, I've, I've seen myself, I've had other surgeries before and I'm still drugged up, dead. I mean, I, can't, I don't even wanna move. I don't feel happy. Uh, and here, it was totally different. I even told Dr. Cabrera when he came in to check on me, I said, are you sure you did surgery on me? Because your hands were light. I mean, usually when you have surgery, you feel real bloated or real, with a lot of pain and you're droggy, but nothing like that. I, I even met Carla, who was uh, the coordinator on all this, and uh, I think his name is uh, Luis. And uh, they're the ones that coordinate all this. And I'm very happy that they gave me the chance and to, to be here. I have nothing but good to say. I've talked to everybody else out here and the, on, the, on the hallways that had the surgery. And they're the same. I mean, they say the same thing. Uh, I am bringing, uh, now that I went through it, I told my sister, let me go through it first. Let me find out if this is for real and legit. Because as we know, there's so many out there, but it's the truth, the honest truth. Everything that you read on the internet about Mexico Biotech Center, it's true. Even the, the building itself, even the heights, even the, the driver, even the coordinators, anyone that you talk to, this is actually the truth. They do have a very clean hospital. They attend to your needs. They don't leave you alone. They, they're actually there to help you. And I'm one that would go through the whole internet looking and looking and looking and I would see different individuals and I kept on but at the same time I kept asking myself, well I know that's them, but what about with me? How, how are they going to react with me? Well, when I got here, you can, I'll, I'll tell you honestly, this is the best one. But the other ones that I've seen, even when you continue looking at their, their people after they've been let go, they you can hear from them how they've had little problems or complications. But as for myself, or all these people that have been here, there was an, a lady, a nurse, in fact, she also had the same surgery. And she's already going over a year and a half, and she's, she still feels great. So make that decision, guys. Make that decision. We all need a little push. We all need to make a difference in our life, and this is it. Mexico Beatrix Center is it. So like my sister's gonna come over, my cousin's gonna come over, and I wouldn't just have them come over if it wasn't a good place to do it. It is, and this is why they're coming over. So do it, guys. Make that call. Call Carla, she'll set you up, all right? Well, it was nice talking to you.